Hello. Today, I'm going to show you how to clone your own voice using the CART AI audio feature. Sounds familiar, right? Let's dive in and see how it works. Yep. The voice you heard at the start of this video was Mr. Beast, and I generated it using CART. With this tool, you can create stunning voices and even clone your own voice completely free of charge. Let's dive in and see how it works. To get started, simply visit the link in the description. Here you'll find a variety of characters that allow you to generate voices. You can also click this drop down and select audio generate to create a new clip or view your previously generated results. All right, now let's see how to train your own voice. To begin, go to audio training. Here you'll need to upload a sample voice recording of yourself around 45 seconds long. You'll also need to fill in all the required fields. Now let's train the Mr. Beast voice and see how it works. Here you can type anything you'd like to hear after the voice is trained. Keep in mind, it will be visible to others if you choose to make this AI audio public. All right, it's time to upload the sample audio of Mr. Beast. Today, we're giving 100 YouTubers the ultimate challenge right here in New York City. Great. After filling in and uploading all the required fields, click Train Now and wait a few minutes for the training process of your new AI audio to complete. Once the training process is complete, you'll automatically be redirected to the AI audio generator. Alternatively, you can find your AI audio by visiting the AI audio section in your profile. Who's ready for this insane challenge? Nice. Now let's try out our very own Mr. Beast voice generator. Today, we're giving 100 YouTubers the ultimate challenge right here in New York City. The last person to complete all the tasks wins. All right, guys, I hope you now know how to train your own voice using CArt's AI audio feature. Plus, you can use it to generate any available voice for free. Give it a try today and comment your thoughts. I'll be back with a new tutorial soon. Bye.